Hi everyone, Nigel here from nigelshaw.com. Many of you know that I am an entrepreneur. I'm a business owner. I'm also a hand therapist. And I, I've been an entrepreneur since 2008, I think. Yeah, 2008. So since 2008 until now, I've constantly defined myself. I went for courses, read books, tested, 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 built a business from, you know, hustled from like 65 bucks to like seven figure business and sold it off. Took a sabbatical. Now I'm helping my wife and doing my other businesses, right? And I want to share with you three ways. These are proven, three proven ways that can grow your business fast. And it doesn't matter whether you are pre-startup. That means you haven't started, started your business. It doesn't matter whether you are a startup. It doesn't matter you have, you know, like 10, 20, 30 employees. It doesn't matter you have a thousand employees. These three ways are evergreen fast ways that will surely grow your business fast. I'll show you some numbers later, okay? It's written over here. Number one, more clients. New clients are the blood flow, the life flow of any business, not just cash flow. The reason being because clients are the one who, when they consume or they buy a service or buy a product from your business, it brings cash flow to your business, okay? So more clients is always required. Also, you must bear in mind that there's a natural attrition. Some clients move away. Some clients um, decide to use another competitor's products, right? So you can't be comfortable and say that, oh, I have 10 clients, I'm happy. No, the 10 clients can shrink to seven, six, five, zero, none, right? So you always you will need to have a system in place to ha always have, have get more new clients. Okay, so this is where broad-based conversation, broad-based teachings. I will zoom into more details if you like this kind of videos. Number two, more frequency, right? So of course, again, getting them to consume, getting your clients to consume more frequently, it depends on what you are providing, okay? Um, selling melons, that's a dollar each. It's easy to sell, you know, to the same client one a day. Melons are easy. But if you are selling like a million dollar property, right? Uh, ideally, my third clients can buy every day. It would be nice, but... Depends on the value of the uh, of the of the products as well. Uh, a, a product that's a dollar is easier to buy very frequently. A product that's a million dollars tend to take a longer time for clients to consider. Talk about financing, talk about investing approaches, things like that. So, let to make things simple. If you're if you have a product that's easy to consume, let's say let's use the example of. Um, FMB sandwiches, right? So instead of getting them, instead of them coming back once a month or once every other, or once every three weeks, you can try to get them back once every two weeks. You know, so let's go. If you go back once a month, get them back twice a month, twice a month, four times a month. No, that's once a week, and then um, increase the number three, increase the value. Increase the value means that you can also charge more. Uh, example back to this example of the sandwich, right? So if you have if you have a sandwich shop selling the basic staples every day, and you are selling uh, the the daily sandwich, and maybe the daily sandwich is like the usual BLT bacon lettuce tomatoes, right? And that goes for say two dollars fifty cents or five dollars. Let's make it five dollars to be easy. And there there will be some clients who are happy to eat the BLT that five dollar BLT every day. But what happens, let's say you on, on Tuesdays, you decide to say, okay, Tuesdays, I'm going to have a special. We're still going to have the BLTs, but on Tuesdays, I'm going to introduce, you can introduce, say, um, a special steak sandwich that goes, that's, you know, goes for $10. And you can see, it's also an experiment. You can do a small batch and see how many people buy. Maybe Instead of 100 people buying your, your basic BLT, you, maybe now you have 75 people buying BLT and 25 people buy the uh, steak sandwich. That's for Tuesdays, right? And then Wednesdays, you can have different things, that's a different thing. So you can build more by providing a higher value item. So with just these three very top tier strategies, it will accelerate your business ridiculously fast. I'm going to give you an example in another slide. Just give me a while. I'm going to change the slide over, okay, to try and make it, give you the illustration, okay. 
Um, so this illustration I'm, I'm giving, this is based on, let's say, a massage therapist. So let's pivot to, to another type of business. Other than a sandwich business, let's apply this to a massage business, okay? Say a massage business has 10 clients every single month. And these clients have, um, they, they have, they, these clients, they decide to have massage every other week, every two weeks, they come back with a massage, they come for a massage. And if, every session they come for, they spend $100. So at the end of the month, you have, the massage therapist will make 2000 a month, right? So say the three examples I gave you, more clients, more frequency, more value. So say you increase 10% of your clients. So instead of having 10, you get a new client. Now you got 11 clients in a month, okay? So instead of them coming back for only two sessions, you come back for 2.2. 2.2 is kind of weird. You come back for three. But just to make things simple, let's, you call it 2.2 right now. Okay, in a month. And then lastly, instead of charging $100, you charge $110 because you're up your price, right? So if you go based on the original one, you make $2,000 a month. But if you increase 10% in terms of your clientele, 10% in terms of the frequency, 10% in terms of bill size, that means you provide, uh, you, to increase your, your bill size, you can you know, use special oils or you can use a certain special products to, to enhance the session. It's like a topping up the session, right? So with that, right, you go to $2,662 a month from $2,000 a month. See the jump? That's an additional $662 a month or 33.1% increase. Would you go, would, they, would people say that, hey, only 662, what? Okay, now let's go into the details, okay? So most of the time, uh, businesses that are like massage therapists, um, their, their cost, if they rent a space, it's going to be really, the space usually, eats, rental usually eats up the um, profits a lot. So most of the time, most massage places, right, they are profitability is around 30, 30-ish percent profitability. So you say if it's $2,000 a month that they make generally, after minusing off expenses, they should make around, their profit should be around 60%, uh, 600 bucks. 600 bucks, okay? After all the expenses, your rent, your, your credit card processor, your, your towel, your laundry, all your business expenses, right? So 600 bucks is your profit. But just with using my three approach, right? More clients, more frequency, more value by 10% each. From 600 bucks right now, you, got, you, got, you have doubled your profit. 600 bucks plus another 662 bucks. You have doubled your profit. And this is how you can grow your business really fast. Doesn't matter what size you are. Just 10%. 10% get more clients. 10 increase their frequency. Increase the bill size by providing more value. There's a three ways you can grow your business really fast. That's what I apply in all my businesses, all the investments that I put into. Three basic ways. If you like this type of videos, let me know. If you want me to dive deeper about how to get more clients, how to get, get them more, back more frequently, how to increase your value, let me know. I love chatting about businesses because I, I really like it a lot. So that's all for me today. Comment down below, like it, share it, subscribe to my channel, and we'll talk soon. Take care. See you. Bye.